such a no! Have a seat. Hello, beautiful people. You're probably wondering why you can't see me right now. Long story short, I'm moving. Before we get into this video, I want to say that this is not meant to bully, harass, or harm anybody. Anything I say is to be taken as a joke. Don't take me serious. And if you do, that sucks because I'm not a lawyer. So what happened originally to get the cops involved is this partially naked woman decided to stand on the end of a street and throw rocks at a truck <laughs> for some reason. She sounds like a mix of Donnie from the Rugrats and the chicken from Moana. The switch up on her attitude is insane. Alrighty, where's the damage in? You got your license and all that good stuff? I just need your license. Everything ready. <laughs> <laughs> you have everything ready. Where exactly did that happen? Well, here, as I was turning, I was just coming home from work. I was here. slowing down on the red light and turning here and... And where was she at? She was actually crossing from that... The Walgreens? Yeah, towards here. And I guess she thought I was going too fast and she was just throwing numbers and whatever faces at me. So you're coming down here? Right here, down the street, I was coming home from work. What was she wearing? She was wearing shorts. Um, her hair is frizzy. Um, I guess it just startled me that I didn't I'm thinking she was wearing brown shorts. But I don't remember the top. I think like a little sweater or something. She doesn't remember the top because there was no top. More rolls than a usual hoodie, but no top. Take a picture of her. So we've been dealing with the last couple of days. I'm sure it's going to be done. Oh, okay. So, so what we're going to need for you to do is when they get to fix it, she's going to give you a case number. You're going to call us back with the estimate. It's going to determine the crime amount. Right now, she's going to be arrested for the vandalism, mm -hmm. but it could be elevated to a felony if it's going to cost more than a thousand dollars, which it will. Mm -hmm. For the glass and the repair and for it to get uh, installed, will be more than a thousand dollars. So, um, but she is going to be charged with it. Mm. And again, we're seeing this all, all, all the time. I mean, if you want her to be charged, now we'll let her go. Um, well, I mean, how could you pay anyway? I'm sure she, she can't. She's, she's absolutely out of her mind on drugs. And that's that's her problem, not yours. No. Um, you know, she needs to be held responsible and accountable for her actions. She can't be walking around this time of day. And she's not wearing any clothes. She didn't have any shirt on. Oh. And so, <laughs> uh, you know, she just can't grab a rock from the landscaping here and throw it and smash her window. Mm -hmm. You know, then she was down there. Uh, trying to get into cars at the lot of oh. and then mess around with the shell. So she's a, she's a public nuisance right now. So mm -hmm. we're going to take her in for the charge that we have now, if you want that. Mm -hmm. And when you get the estimate, we can elevate it to a felony. Okay. And then uh, that way we can kind of help you out with that a little bit, okay? You got to feel bad for this lady because she was just on the way home, minding her business, and then all of a sudden someone just throws a rock at your car. That sucks, dude. And she was taking care of her 90-year-old dad. Wild. All right. So this gentleman's gonna give you that information. Give you your sheet up. Okay. So you're gonna get books for the vandalism. For so breaking. you're gonna get books for assaulting me. No. We'll yeah, say you assaulted me, bitch. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Took it was off on running. camera. Border patrol sheriff's office. It was on camera right here. Oh, bitch. So when I tell you you're under arrest and you take off running, yeah. No, that doesn't legitimize you hitting me in the head. Actually, I didn't hit you in the head. You did. You no, hit hard. I did not hit you hard. You if I wanted it. If, if I did, if I did, you don't. You'd Bitch, still be on the ground. You have okay. a I have a what? A or something. No. No. 
Yeah. So I you can definitely touch it. Play ambulance again? No. Did you hit me so hard? No. I'll take you to the hospital, but you don't get an ambulance, okay? You'd be just fine. Absolutely not. She's very entitled for someone that looks like an undercooked Hillsbury doughboy. It's crazy that she thinks she's in any right to make demands or threats in this situation. Lady, you are half naked throwing rocks at cars. High out of your mind. Outstanding Citizen Award. Um, so you're going to be charged with vandals for breaking that lady's window, throwing a rock at her, okay? That's not cool. This lady had nothing to do with anything today. No, nope, that was you. She identified you. So you're going to be charged with it. How did she identify me? Hmm. It was your super long personalities. By a photograph we took of you. Uh, so here you go. We'll take you to the hospital if you want to get medically cleared. But uh, there's nothing wrong with you, but we'll, we'll waste their time and our money. Don't take me with Steve now. Absolutely not. You're going to jail. So you got whatever's going on, we got to temper this, okay? This behavior is not acceptable. They also said that you're trying to get into cars over at the Lotta Burger, okay? Whatever's going no, on, we got to figure that out. It no, wasn't. Was yeah, they said black shorts naked. With the We're all black shorts naked. Uh, you are. One of the officers explained the situation to the suspect. It's Paul, I'm not judging you. I'm yeah. not, okay? You gotta understand what's going on here, all no, right? No, I that lady didn't do anything wrong. She's an elderly lady who's taking care of her dad who's 95 years old with yeah, dementia. Care of my family, so she... I get it, but now she has to pay for a broken window because somebody. Okay, I'll pay for it. That would be nice. I'll get her a new truck, right? I don't know. She doesn't want a new truck. Oh, yeah. I know a windshield guy. I know. So, here's the thing. Here's the thing. What's going on that this behavior is coming about? I've never seen you before. I'm done with Northside, you know? They're up the Northside gang here in Long Cruise. That's old school. Mm. That's way, way old. They, they put a trap of lockdown. Inside this, what did they call that? Desert of Hope. Desert of Hope. No, no, no. There's a trap on the east. And, uh, Are you on any other medications? Have you been diagnosed with anything? Do you have to have anything? Like what? Like what? Uh, I don't know if I can see it. I have Bipolar? TBI. I'm the pimp slapper around the world, right? The pimp slapper? That nigger hit me so hard. He hit me where, where, where was this at? In Albuquerque. Oh, in Albuquerque? When was that? Uh, I used to have one year. This year? Yeah, the one year. Oh, the, the, the pimp or whatever you want to call him? He's um, still up in Albuquerque? No, my dad's in California right now. No, but you're... He, the, the guy who runs the desert road. The one who stole your, the one, yeah, the one who stole your. Oh no, no, that's meds. Tycho. That's one Tycho. of the twins, right? Yeah. The and shifty twins. And he's still up at the desert road. No, he's very shifty because he's got a twin, right? Mm -hmm. So they're everywhere. So that's how they. Well, people, right? well here's, here's the thing. Here's the thing, okay? Mm -hmm. Does this happen in broad daylight? Mm -hmm. You're gonna have to go in for the trespassing. She wanted charges pressed on you, okay? Mm -hmm. What happened happened, yeah. okay? Listen, my concern is to get you the medical help and the intervention help that you're gonna need. Yeah, yeah. Can we appreciate these kind of cops? The ones that genuinely give a fuck, like, it looks like he's really de-escalating and trying to figure out this situation. Like, what a great human being. He's genuinely de-escalating the situation and talking to her like a normal person. All right, so, okay, well, here's the thing. You know, whatever, whatever's going on with your TBI and all the other stuff, we got to get you regulated on real meds, not fentanyl, not clear. Um, no, not blues and not myself. clear. I'm trying, I'm trying to figure out what we can do to get you off the streets, because this behavior is going to start to escalate. my grandma's then. I can't. I got I got it. If she wants to charge, I, it's not me. You got to be booked, okay? But when you take off running and you have no clothing on, how am I supposed to get you to stop? Right. I could have. I could have tased you. I could have tackled you. Should have tased me, actually. And then you'd fall face first on the concrete, so? and your face would be busted open. Gotcha. All right. I'm just gonna spin here on this way because I'm not gonna show everybody your stuff, okay? I don't want them to. I'm, I'm not that guy, okay? I know you think it's okay, but I do not. Turn this one on your wrist this way. Okay. 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 Wait, that one's a little too tight. Too late. You gotta turn your wrist up. This way. Yeah. This way. Uh, one, two, three, There you go. Better? Yeah. Just put your hands together. Clap your hands together. Just like that. Okay. Moral of the story. Don't do drugs and throw rocks at cars. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, please like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff, and a very special thank you to Printing Press 3D. Bro, I fucking love you, dude. Every time you comment, it, like, puts a smile on my face. Bro, thank you so much. Like, I, I genuinely hope you're a subscriber until I die. I, I fucking love you, bro. Thank you. And, um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time.